right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome out to a concert night with Escapade. We're a bunch of people whose escape from hell has been paid by the blood of Jesus. I hope you have a wonderful time tonight as you watch. This song's called Hope I'm In. Changed, but I ain't changed. I used to roll out all black, tight and nice. I'm still black, tight and nice. Instead of pulling gas past the nice, now I'm flicking the flyers and telling guys about the Christ. We're outside standing, looking out, standing, telling by standing backsliders. Sin poisons you, set apart from the dark. I stand out like bergs of loot. I still know ratings for the boys in blue. I'm law abiding, but I'm lawless. And saved by grace, made haste while his day I pay attention to the lawless. It's more stress when you get to sleep, and there's no rest when you rest in peace if you ain't saved. Chains and Bruce Jenner can do with a dress. I got saved and made heaven my home. I went back to my yard with a new address. I've been impressed by the bread of life, so now I got more hunger than Budapest. next song we're going to sing for you is called Grateful um, and this song is close to me because that's my testimony a few years ago you got to look back what 13 14 years ago I was on the streets of East London just not so far from here um, I was involved in a lot of uh, that gang stuff I was raised in a good home I was I was top in class it's just we started off playing football in the park riding our bikes, stealing dust caps from cars, then breaking into cars, then breaking into homes, and, and it just kept on snowballing and accelerating, and that's what sin does. Uh, and in 2006, I had an encounter with Jesus Christ that changed my life. Uh, my story could have been completely different. So for that reason, I, I am grateful uh, for what God's brought me from and where he's brought me to today. I've got four beautiful children, uh, awesome wife, 
and uh, we get to be a part of this. So, um, so I hope this song ministers to you. That's what it's called. Grateful. I'm so grateful you took my sin. How can I repay my debt? Back in the day, I'll be definitely on the streets. We might be share the taste, the better laid in the heat. I don't know about the rest, but definitely get me G. The I ain't talking birds when it crests, just getting bees all day. We sat and rest unless we went to sleep. And even when we slept, our heads still went at peace. I don't invite a guest, his interest will see us bleed. So we had to invest in weapons to make it bleed. Cause I hear in the West, the first impressions are key. We spent our love investment in just dressing the please. We had street creds and reputation to keep. And so we're always stressing, participating and beat. I was destined for greatness, eight grades with pizza, accelerating to death or even in jail with the least. I heard it by his death and my savior blend in a tree. If not, I still be asking the question, where would I be? Undeserving, unworthy, not for grace and his mercy. I should definitely perish, should be far from the cherish, should be dead and be buried and live in nobody's memory. You said I'm happily married, take your dad and the parent, hey, for my chains, Christ came, right, you died to get you and I saved. You see your life with my Christ, it's just to live, then you die. But with Christ, you can live when you die. Tell him. God's good. I know he is. I know he's good. I know he's so good. I get to know him when I pray. I wake up then I pray. So it's better you can say I'm up to no good. I'm brainwashed but my shop. Brought me down and built me up. That's my craft. I tell a Christ and no talk of paradise. I'll treat your life like a paradise. You can make paradise. Wouldn't give us airplane. Let's compare faith. Fair say we say it how we hear it. It's in hearsay. Money driven fell safe. So they fell safe. But if you fell safe, ever fell safe. Hey, the price he paid, it was all my days. So now for all my days, so you are all my days. Died of Calvary and bled to his death through his arteries. So it was pure. Who said it died in vain? Talented, beautiful, I'm okay. Let's give it up. And we got Tolu on my right on the BVs. She only sings on Thursdays, but we paid her for today. And right over here, we got Francis on the keys, Miss C. Lee on the keys. And right behind me, we got Mr. Groovy K, Kavar Lynch on the bass. And on all the electric guitars, we got our very young Romanian John Mayer. Give it up for you, Newt. And last but not least, we got the most talented Lynch in the building. We had to set up a whole camera angle just for him. Let's give it up for James Lynch. Say, Lord, I'm grateful that you waited. I betrayed you. You were faithful, and I 
won't make it and I'm both racing. And all I wasted and you replaced it. All my babies, you were patient. The price you paid, no, I can't be paid. And I won't make it and I'm both racing. It's all I wasted and you replaced it. Say, yeah. song is called Grateful. Um, so throughout the night, ladies and gentlemen, there's, there's a number on the screen, there's a number in the description. If at any point you feel, you know, or you want to pray, you want somebody to pray with you, you want somebody to help lead you to Jesus Christ, just text that number and somebody will be in touch with you. So this next song is called All I Want Is You. And uh, not, nothing is ever enough. You think about anything you set out to acquire. Every time you acquire whatever you wanted, there's always something else to attain to. And there's never going to be any satisfaction. What does it profit a man if you gain the whole world and you lose your soul? So this song is called All I Want Is You. can flow into an ocean but it's not satisfied and all that the work is is vanity and none can last the time and I searched the whole world and I found nothing else can take no when everything else fails, you remain always faithful. All I want is you. All I want is you. All I want is you now. Jesus, I know that you know. Oh, oh, oh. I need them. That's why on a certain day I got convicted and I shifted to the spot and prayed. Didn't want God to rage, I turned from my rotten ways. While my slate clean and I was happy like I got engaged. And that's the realest thing. What's the feeling is? I was half-hearted, but now I'm really feeling this. I never had freedom. Well, I thought I did. I was like a slave moving freely in sin. And what's really insane is somehow I thought I could do what I want. Then somehow it's love. Can somehow I just drop me in the heavens, feeling his presence. That would be a dream if it happened. The Lord would be that keeper. I never put my feet up. I was the same thinking I needed a weapon, but now lost my shepherd and I shall not want. I'm not a pay, so I shall not run. Hey, listen, I searched the whole world and nothing else can take. No, your place, cause when everything else fills, you remain always faithful. All I want is you. Shoot. 
give you my testimony, which is basically a story of how I met Jesus. Uh, my name's Tolu, by the way. Hi, everyone watching. Um, so growing up, I grew up in basically your typical Nigerian, British kind of household when I was growing up. So we would go to church every Sunday, really. Um, I just plodded along, not really understanding who God was. Literally didn't have a clue who he was really I just going because my family went so that was just the story and what we did and um, fast forward up until the age of 12 it's probably what's the word like a pivotal moment in my life was when my parents separated and I really I really do think that changed me a lot kind of became a bit of a recluse um, uh, dealt with a lot of bitterness I guess you could say and anger there was a lot of unanswered questions and um, yeah, I kind of went into myself and that really affected me. Um, and so eventually we started looking for a church to go to. Well, my mum started looking for a church to go to and um, came across the Potter's House Church. And yeah, we, we started going and my sister, my, my big sister actually got saved before me. I uh, got saved a couple of months later. Um, because I kind of, I was just feeling so empty at that. It's quite a young age to feel that way, but yeah, I was. I started having thoughts of, you know, why am I here? Didn't really know what my purpose was, what, yeah, what I was here for. And then I heard a sermon. It was actually about the Holy Ghost, and it just made me realize, wow, there's actually a lot more to God than I realized. And I'm actually it just made me realize how empty I was and how much I needed Him in order to make it through in life. And so. I gave, I gave my life to Christ, yeah, when I was 13, almost 14 years old, and um, kind of, he gave me a purpose, Jesus gave me a purpose, and he just made my heart warm, I guess, and um, I found true happiness in Jesus, and if you're watching this live stream, you're not just watching because someone sent you a link, there really is more to it than that. Um, if you don't know Christ, then get to know him. Give him a chance. You've got nothing to lose. I mean, there's so much uncertainty in this world right now. and But with Jesus, you can have certainty. It's like getting insurance for your soul. No matter what happens on this earth, you know that because you've got Jesus with you, you can go through anything, really. He can, he can make your broken heart whole, and he can give you that certainty. Um, I just, yeah, we really hope that these songs speak to you and that you will be touched. Thanks for listening to me. So if at any time you want to know more, you want somebody to speak to you and so you can learn more, you want somebody to pray with you, there's a number on the screen and a number in the description also you can text. We've got um, a bunch of people that are already waiting on the phone lines to speak to you. So this next song we're going to do for you is called Mercy. And uh, mercy is something that's uh, is God's grace and God's, God's choosing not to, to, to punish us for what we did, to help us to rebuild. And you catch that theme throughout the concert. I hope this song ministers to you. Uh, mercy. Took my life in the arrangements and now I am not the same. I shed his blood all across me. Mercy, 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 mercy
I deserve nothing but death. He gave me life abundantly. I was a slave with no options, but now I'm free. Mercy, 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 Awesome. All right. Um, this next song. This next song is called Bokeh. Um, Bokeh, Boka. Um, some of you who have um, phones is your portrait mode or live live focus mode. Um, in a camera, in camera terms, is is when something is in focus, and that thing is the only thing that's in focus and sharp and the frame. Everything else is blurred out. I was initially going to call the song FOMO. I wrote this song this week. And, and the idea is if you think about sin, the very first sin was because of fear of missing out. Adam and Eve had the whole garden. They had everything in the garden. It was theirs. They named the animal kingdom. They did all of that stuff. But there's just one tree that was in the focus. And they couldn't ignore this tree. And because of the fear of potentially missing out on the power and everything that this and enlightenment this tree can give them, they ignored everything else, they ignored God's promises, ignored the safety, and then here we are, the fall of man. So this song's called Boca. I hope this song ministers to you. So snap that tree right in focus. Enjoy the moment before it's long. Jeez, as it take aim, oh, freeze, desires in frame, oh, please, my shoulders don't speak, I told my conscience just shut up, don't speak, and I, I don't think deep, no, I saw what I reap, oh, got a death in my field, yeah, as long as I can capture that tree, yeah. What I'm missing keeps blurring my vision, ignoring my privilege. Oh. The fear of what I'm missing keeps blurring my vision, ignoring my privilege. Oh. Yeah. So every day I 
gotta edit my shape I keep polishing stains The kind of retouching can change right Not until Christ poured The filtering eyes God So through eyes of love God So through eyes of love The fear of what I'm missing that it's called Start Over. So listen to the words of the church.
powerful song, Starting Over. Anyway, we're going to have some more music shortly, but if you just lend me your ears for a few minutes. Um, I've had the worst luck with cars. I mean, for somebody that works with cars, I've got rotten luck with cars in the past couple of years anyway. And uh, to put it this way, I've been driving for 11 years, and I've got five years no claim, so... I've only had two faults, so I don't, I don't, know, I don't know how it happened, but um, that's where it is. So a couple of years ago, I was, I was attending. I was going to one of the sessions we have on Saturday morning with the guys. And I'm in traffic. The car slows down, so we slow down. And then the car accelerates, so we accelerate. And the car emergency brakes, and then I smash into his back. And it was a Jaguar. It was a Jaguar XJ. And, uh, yeah, just smashed this car to pieces at the back. My car was okay. I drive a Volvo. Get a Volvo. So, and, um, and uh, so I smashed this car to pieces. And I was like, it's the worst time. Things are tight. I just, I just can't, I can't deal with this. And literally, my insurance was about to cycle over to the next year. So I could have gotten a whole year no claims. Literally, I was one month away. And uh, that really, that put me in a bad mood. And I was just dreaming and wishing wishing I can, I can um, change, change things. I wish I never came that morning. I wish I was running late or I was much earlier so I don't have to have that encounter. I mean, the whole day I was philosophizing. Um, I, was, I had one of the guys with me and we were playing around with the idea. Imagine, imagine everybody, or well, if imagine a few people had the opportunity to rewind time. And then we were playing around with the four and we said, no, okay, maybe everybody gets a chance. Everybody gets a token to rewind time. When would you use yours and what would you use yours for? So we're thinking, oh, maybe if my mom dies, I can use it. Or if your dad dies, who gets, who gets it? Who gets it? Your girlfriend? Your, your dad? Your, your, your brother? Who gets it? And so we're thinking, who are you going to use it for? Do you save it for yourself? And, um, and so we said, as you imagine, and around that time, we had the issue, the, the, the disaster in Grenfell Tower. And I can imagine, imagine everybody had this opportunity. And on that day when the, issue, when the, when the disaster happened in Grenfell, you would have seen everybody using their tokens popping up all over the place just so we can rewind time and do things differently this, this thought this this sentiment resonates with most of us um everyone it resonates with everyone if you look at what happens every new year's there's that desire to start over and do something start again now um, unfortunately this this device or this token this technology doesn't exist or does it i don't know um but it, there is one thing that's been available from the beginning the opportunity to start over the Bible says in, in 2 Corinthians that everybody in Christ Jesus becomes a new creation and old things pass away and all things become new. So we don't need to look for any technology. The opportunity to start over is, is here. And, and we get to the point where we wish we can return and swap or we can, we can turn back the hands of time because of sin. If we go back to the beginning, because of sin, and that's why we have this issue. Why, why don't things just work out the way it should work out? Why do we have tragedies? Why do I keep doing the things I wish I don't do? Sin is to miss the mark. That's missing the criteria. You imagine entering a competition and you look at your position and you see these guys are way more prepared and talented than I am. And you feel so low. Sin is you miss that mark. You don't make it. And, and, and so, so we have this point. You could, either, you could either stay like that and you can try and rationalize it away. Some of us turn to abuse and alcohol. So we spend our whole week just to get to the weekend and we can drink away our week and we do it all over again. But Jesus Christ is offering you the opportunity to start over. Some of you are great workers. You're excellent at your work. You're creative, you're talented. Your managers praise you. You run your own business, is excelling. You're highly creative, but in your personal life, you have no control. You're bound by addiction. So Jesus Christ is offering a chance for you to start over and everything in Christ becomes new. And for those of you watching at home, if you would like to, if you would like to start over, you would like Jesus Christ to forgive you for your sins. You would like a do-over. I've blown it. I've blown it. There's certain things I've done I'm not proud of. There's certain things that makes me wish I can actually just go back in time. The newness that Jesus offers isn't time. It's a newness in form. There's a newness in quality. You're transformed to something that you weren't. So you, you don't trust yourself. You're not reliable. You tried it many years. You tried a lifestyle change. You tried the resolutions and you failed. You don't trust it. But Jesus Christ can give you a steadfast spirit. David, David prays, cast me not away 
in your presence will renew a steadfast spirit. God can give you a steadfast spirit. Backslider, come home. You can start over tonight. And if you want to do that, there's a number on the screen. There's a number in the description. You just text that number. And you pray with me tonight. You just say this after me. Where you're standing in your room, in your bedroom, kitchen, wherever you are. You pray with me tonight. You say, just say after me. Say, Lord Jesus, I'm a sinner. Forgive me for my sins. Come into my heart and be my savior. I believe that you died on the cross for my sins and you rose again. Give me the strength to choose righteousness. And I thank you for a second chance on a second chance. Amen. That's your start over and all your slates is wiped clean. Your record is wiped clean. That's it. And there's no catch. No catch. You are now a new creation. Your reputation that the past is the past. Now you're a new person. And angels are rejoicing in heaven because of your decision. If you prayed, we would like to know. We would like to know. Text that number. Just text saved with your name. And somebody will get in touch with you. Uh, we're going to do some more songs. But, but spend this time. This is a wonderful opportunity. It's a wonderful privilege to do this. And I'm glad I'm able to lead you in prayer. Wherever you are in the world, if you can't text the UK number, maybe send an email or go on the website. But for those of you who can, send that send a text with your name. Amen. We'll do some songs for you before we wrap up. Amen. We'll go. Okay, this song is called Damage is Done.
nature that keeps us far from God. No way to judgment day when the damage is done. Amen. Don't wait till judgment day because by then it will be too late. So this next song is called Cardboard Mountains. I wrote this song a year ago. And uh, this is a song that happened, uh, I wrote at a time of um, darkness. Um, my wife and I lost our child. And uh, the image I got, I, I got when I was inspired by this song is if you imagine a cardboard cutout and uh, you cut out the profile of a mountain and you can flash a torch or light behind that mountain, that mountain can cast incredible shadows. It can be something it actually isn't. Uh, but just by changing the orientation of that light, the mountain can become so insignificant. And uh, that's, that's the power of the light of Jesus Christ coming into your life. Um, God helped us through. We came through smoke-free and we're standing here today. And if you want to know the same God and you want to know that and experience the same power, there is a number in the description screen. You can, you can text that description. You can, you can text that uh, and somebody will pray with you. Amen. I hope this song ministers to you. Let's go.
song this this next song is uh it's called recusing love and uh that's the image of a judge who's also helping a convict to escape and that judge should surely recuse himself but that's the judge that we that we know the god that we believe and serve is a god that doesn't want to judge doesn't want to see anybody go to hell that he would make a way that we be we won't be convicted and um yeah i pray that minister see you Necessary thing is the price he gave us. Christ he gave us. The life he gave us. The sense where we begin. Try liberty to those who believe. Just know the Holy Ghost in the fields lies best to be. Hope, peace of mind. Let his glory shine. Grace is saved, in spite of knowing all we've done. Count your blessings one by one. You see how far we come. His love is never ceasing. His love is filled with blood. Concealing every secret. Protection from the Lord. His freedom means surrender. Conviction that restores. Forgiveness that remembers. No righteous from before. Da 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 It can be terrifying to be slowly dying. Yet you watch them crying because of love you let it bleed. No kind of mess that I'm in can compare to my king. Oh, death, where is thy sting? The end's where we begin. Joy and liberty to those who need. Just know the Holy Ghost who reveals life's best to be. Hope and peace of mind. Let us glow and shine. Grace the same in spite of knowing all we've done. Catch your blessings one by one. You see how far. Love is never ceasing. His love is filled with blood, concealing every secret. Protection from the Lord. His freedom means surrender. Conviction that restores. Forgiveness that remembers. No ashes from before. His love is never ceasing. His love is filled with blood, concealing every secret. Protection from the Lord. His freedom means surrender. Conviction that restores. 
forgiveness never remembers No lashes fall before His love is never ceased His love is filled with blood He's sealing every secret Protection from the Lord As freedom means surrender Conviction that restores Forgiveness that remembers No lashes fall before Da 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 Protection from the Lord. The speed on me surrender. Conviction that restores. Forgiveness that remembers. No actions fall before. Amen. All right, so that song, Recuse in Love. I mean, if you're still watching or you're listening and you were in two minds earlier, or maybe you don't trust religion you've had bad encounters or you've heard bad things about religion this is not religion that we're offering this is a relationship with Jesus Christ and I'm praying that God will open your eyes and you can see the signs of the times that we're living in at this very moment in a very in a moment in an instant everything that we knew about the world changed and some of you the things that you've been building your life on those have been shaken the things that we trust and we put our security in now we can see that they're fallible. Nothing is permanent in this world. The Bible says that it's appointed for once, once for a man to die, and then after that comes judgment. You're not on exclusion. This applies to every one of us. And in this downtime, God has given us a time to reconsider, to reevaluate what is really important. The eternal. You can have the opportunity tonight to have an eternal destiny with Jesus Christ. And it's a simple prayer. And if you would like to do that, you just say after me. This is available for every one of us. God doesn't want to see anyone die or go to hell. And that's why he's made a way. For those of us who ignore, judgment lays at the door. So just say this prayer after me. If you'd like to have a new start with Jesus Christ, you'd like to repent from your sins. And you just say, Lord Jesus, I'm a sinner. Forgive me for my sins. Come into my heart and be my savior. I believe that you died on a cross and you rose again. I thank you for a second chance on a second chance. Give me the strength to choose righteousness. And that's it. That's a brand new start. And that's what this whole concert was put on for. A bunch of people whose escape from hell has been paid. We're out here to let everyone else know so you can escape as well. You don't have to be bound by sin. So this last song we're going to do for you is called True Love Dies. Amen. I hope this song will minister to you. off that is off my guitar is off that is wrong oh there we go